Uh, the history, well, that I know about it, it's been here well over 200 year old, as far as I know. No, no stalls or anything, it was all just, just with just space on the ground, you know, you just put your, your bundles down and that was it. That's the oh, okay. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Well, all my life, you may as well say, uh, well, I worked on all for by doing it, but my mother was down here, you know, my mother was here before me, and my brother, he he was a, um, he was a bracket man, he used to sell the coal brackets, you know, coal. But that's my brother there, uh -huh. yes. It's always been a sweet market. So it's over 50 years in the one-year market. We're just, well, all sorts, nearly everything. Everything but the kitchen sink. <laughs> Hello, Hello. 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 All sorts, but there are a lot of very nice people that come, nice customers and that, that come here. And sometimes there's a really meeting place for some of them. Maybe them to the restaurant for their tea and that, you know. I've always liked it and it always it gets me out of you well every day. I like to pass my time down here if you well. Then I like to the company, the company's good, great company, you know. Great company. So, You talk like an angel, but I got wise. You're the devil in disguise. Oh, yes, you are. Devil in disguise. Ooh. You fooled me with your kisses. You cheated and you skipped. Heaven knows how you lied. A social function. It is. Uh, it is. It has long since lost its way. I think it's. It's patronising to suggest that somehow that 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 reflects what in class heritage of Glasgow, drug dealing, the contraband, sale of stolen goods, prostitution, car theft, serious assault that has uh, afflicted that area for too long. We simply cannot ignore that. I think their plan is 
supposedly an upper class Camden market for artists and people selling foreign produce. Why this councillor wants to close this, he has classed this as a crime ridden midden. I stand by that, it is a crime ridden midden. Some of the issues are feasible, some of them are doable, but allow us to do them. We are setting up a trust, Paddy's Market Trust, and we are drawing up a plan to give to Glasgow City Council and give to Network Rail that we are able and capable of cleaning up Paddy's Market. We can work with the Glasgow City Council if need be. Did you sign that? Bless you. <laughs> You've been warm. I don't know where I am. I know, I know I'm fine, I've been asked. I know you're right. <laughs> It's all part of Glasgow's history, isn't it, really? Um, people have came here for generations. You can get all here. Well, the shoppers are very angry because it, a lot of people said we couldn't afford to go to the shops. You come down here with a five and get yourself a rig out. Otherwise, you couldn't get into the shops and do that. You couldn't get into the shops and do that. Why I fight? Because this is my livelihood, this is my living. Where else can we have the same community spirit? They'll never recreate a Paddy's Market. To me this should be heritage. It's been here 200 years, keep it. Don't let it go. Thou shalt have no other market before Paddy's. Thou shalt not make me into a new image. Thou shalt not take the name of Paddy's in vain. Thou shalt not steal from Paddy's. Honour thy friends and thy buyers. Thou shalt not be a false witness about Paddy's. Thou shalt not commit drugs. Thou shalt not go without tea or coffee. Remember the Sabbath day, don't work. You shall not kill Paddy's.